Here is another little uh, RPI3 gadget, and this is really neat. I use this on the Media Center. Uh, this is an iPaz port, I P A Z Z P O R T, and that's the All Star system. I will turn that down. And uh, this is a little mini keyboard, and right here, what you have is basically a mouse pad. Uh, same thing as what you'd have on a laptop. It's a full keyboard. Uh, you can navigate through uh, different things using the arrow keys. Uh, pretty much all the keys you need are on this little thing. And it's, uh, I don't know what, uh, $15 to $17, something like that. You can get it on Amazon. Really neat little device. Just plug it in. Comes with a little, a little uh, a dongle. Plug it into a USB port on your Raspberry Pi, and voila, you've got an instant keyboard for your Raspberry Pi. Works really well. It's got an on-off switch, which is right there, but it does go into standby. Shuts itself off automatically, and to reactivate it, to relink, all you have to do is just touch like the one of these keys, the enter key, and uh, away it goes. It's worked great. Had it a week. Uh, I just ordered another one, believe it or not. And what you want, this one does not have the feature. What you want is the the same one, but it has a backlight function. This one does not have a backlight function. So if it's dark in the room, which I like it dark, because I may uh, uh, I like to hibernate, you have to have a little bit of light to see uh, to read what each of the keys uh, read the numbers and letters on the keys. Um, the backlight function function. I'm looking forward to that. That's coming tomorrow. Uh, that's it. Uh, enjoy. 7-3, Green Mountain Maniac.